Hey guys, my name is Natalie and in today's video I'm going to go ahead and show you how I'm packing my ears for my Walt Disney World trip uh, in order for them to go in my luggage. A lot of my ears are custom made but I also have a lot of park originals and I want to make sure that my ears get there safe. Mainly the ones that are from like Etsy just because they're custom made and I don't want to risk not being able to purchase them again. So. I was looking on YouTube for a lot of ways to pack my ears and everybody has the little bags that you could pack them in. However, I didn't want to use those just because, again, I have a lot of custom made ears that I do not want to distort in any sort of way. And a lot of them were gifts from my husband, from my sister. So I just want to make sure they get there fine and they get back fine. I am going from California to Florida. Um, I will be there for the Toy Story Land opening and I guess I'm going to go ahead and show you what I purchased in order to pack my ears. Um, I did notice actually just last night that there is some kind of case that you can purchase and you can pack your ears in there and just kind of carry it as a carry on. However, I had no clue this thing existed. I didn't know. Again, I looked on YouTube numerous times trying to find a way of how to get my ears to Orlando safely with no problems. So, since it was too late, I can't purchase the case anymore because I'm literally living tomorrow. Um, there's no way I can get it. So, I decided to figure out a way for myself. I had ordered some ears on Etsy. And those ears came in a little box. I decided to go over to Office Depot. I found a box similar to it, but a little bit wider um, that fits two ears. I'm taking a total of, I believe, eight ears. The park ones are a little bit more sturdier, so I'm not worried about those. Um, it's mainly my custom ones, but there are for example, a pair of ears that my mom bought me, ooh, I want to say like six years ago. They are my first ears, and since she bought those for me, I do take extra care of them. I also have seen them in the parks now, and they look nothing like the ones that my mom got me. The ones that I have, the bow is like perfectly fine, and they look super cute. The ones now, for some reason, the bow is not the cutest. Um, I don't know if they changed it. I have no clue. But, uh, now on to show you my packing. So, I did purchase these boxes. And, again, I got them at Office Depot. Um, I don't have the sizes. Maybe I should have looked at that. I believe it's 12 by 9 by 5. Yes. Um... I will try to look for the numbers and maybe try to link them below if I can figure out a way to do that. This is my first YouTube video, so I don't know. Um, and I also purchased these foams, which are 12 by 12. Um, and then there are this brand. So, I decided that I could put two pairs of ears in each box. The case came with three boxes uh so let me go ahead and show you how i got that together okay so i'm only gonna do a box so two ears um these are the ears i'm gonna go ahead and slip them into the little foam bag and then kind of like fold it over keep them like this like a little pouch then I'll go ahead and do the other ears. Same thing. Put them in here. By the way, how cute are those ears? And then, same thing. I'll go ahead and place them in the box. One... I'm kind of doing like one facing me and then one facing like the box cover um, just to keep like each ear in their own little spot. So here we go. 
And then I'm probably gonna have to use like packing tape or something just because they are a little bit more um, bulky than the box itself. So, then I'm gonna go ahead and close up the box. ears are packed. There you go. And that's it. That's how I'm packing my ears. Again, I'm probably going to have to tape it down because it does kind of like come up a little, but that's no big deal. I believe that this will work just fine. I am using the Caltech luggage, the hard shell, so the inside is pretty, pretty hollow. So I'm hoping that all three boxes will fit. Um, I am packing one pair of yours, I believe it's these ones, in my bag with me that I'm taking with me to the park because when I arrive, we do have reservations at the Polynesian for breakfast and I want to make sure that I am ready to go because our room will not be ready. Um, also, since I'm already doing this, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys if you have or haven't heard people do custom little envelopes for housekeeping. And they don't call it housekeeping, they call it mousekeeping. So, um, I didn't get to do custom, custom envelopes, even though I have a Cricut, so I shut up. Um, but, Shop Disney had a sale going on, I believe it's still on. Um, this is June 2018. So the sale is still on as of now. Um, and it was for the Ufupis. And they were buy one, get two free. So I went ahead and I purchased six Ufupis. But I believe I'm staying a total overnight. So I think it's only five nights, maybe six. So I went ahead and purchased an Ufupi. Because I'm going to go ahead. I'm a little extra. I'm going to go ahead and put an Ufufi with an envelope and their tip for each day, well, I guess each night that we're there. Um, I wanna go ahead and show you that as well. So let me show you. Okay, so here we go. Let's start with Mickey and Minnie. So for the first night that we're there, we're gonna go ahead and leave a mini Ufufi as well as the envelope that I made. These are just like gift card envelopes that I ordered off of Amazon. Um, I believe it was like $4 for 50. Um, and then I just put stickers and then I wrote mousekeeping out. Um, you can't really see it too good on the camera, but it, it is legible in person. Um, and then this is a me. Then we have the Mickey movie. And then the Mickey envelope that I made. And then we have Donald Ufufi. And the Donald envelope that I made. There wasn't any like Donald stickers, so I had to improvise. Um, then we made, but well, we have Daisy. And then I made the Daisy envelope. Again, there wasn't any Daisy or Donald stickers, so I just improvised. And then I have. Snow White, and this is the envelope I made for her. I believe that sticker is actually Bambi, but you know how she has like little animals and reindeers and all kinds of stuff in the movie. I thought it was fitting. So there's her envelope, and then I have Marie, and the envelope I made for Marie, and that is it. Um, I hope you guys stick around. This is my very first video. Um, later on, I want to film a what I'm packing for Disney World. Um, not that I'm a pro, because again, it's my first trip. But um, at least you guys can kind of get some ideas. And also, I'm pretty much packing whatever I would if I stayed in a hotel down in Anaheim. I do tend to do that, um, even though we don't live far from Disneyland at all. It's probably about an hour away sometimes less with no traffic um but so we do tend to get hotels down in anaheim and stay there and then so i get to pack my stuff so i'm kind of packing like 
same sort of way except obviously I'm taking a lot more things because it's a longer trip um so I hope you guys stick around and subscribe and hopefully you'll like what I have to show you um yeah that's it thanks thanks for watching thanks for staying tuned I hope that that boxing video was totally helpful for you um, just because like I said nobody really shows you how to get your ears safely from home to Florida and I just believe that that was a great way to do it so let me know if that works for you thanks a lot for watching and have a great day bye